Hi everyone! We're back again. Welcome back again to the Kerr Donnelly Band Spring TV Show 2019 well, Part it's been 1. for a while, haven't we? No, it's just we've done what? Summer one, summer autumn, one. Christmas, but a few years ago since we did the spring one, I think. Yeah. You know what I mean? But it's great to have young Josh. Look at this fine bit of a lad, you know what I mean? Handsome chap he is. Handsome chap. We used to be like that one. Yeah, one yeah. That's why we bring all, the, all these young boys on. To bring all the young females. It makes us look good as well. And and okay. males, because you know what I mean? We're not being... What's that? Fascinating males. Sexist or whatever you call sexist. it. Sexist. Sexy. That's the one. We ain't been sexy. <laughs> we can never sexy male, to be honest with you. <laughs> Thank you again, mate, for coming on board. I hope it's been worthwhile coming over the Welsh. You have to come over the Welsh hills to get to yeah, it. Yeah, I do like driving through the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> He's a mad nut to this one, isn't he? <laughs> like M5 job. Anyway, <laughs> shall we get back to being serious? It never happens with us. Nope. Roth? Uh, welcome back. Uh, what's your new song called? Uh, moving On. Moving On, and what's the story behind that one? Um, it's like struggling to get over a relationship, really. You see they're moving on and you can't do it, yeah? Yeah. Oh, that old chestnut. <laughs> <laughs> but it works, though, mate, it works. Got a few songs on it. I know, yeah. I think everybody can do that. Full out, mate, that one. It's country music, isn't it? That is. <laughs> So, what we're going to do now, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get out of the way and let young Josh do his new song. Is this going to be recorded soon, mate? That's that already. Is it already? Yeah, is that yeah. single or not? Uh, single on Spotify. Is that, is that the one I bought? Yeah. I, I, no, I bought that one. <laughs> I did listen to it, honestly. So, so go ahead and buy it. So, so go ahead and buy it. It's called Moving On. It's on iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, and all them ones. You know what I mean? So, um, let's get him <clears throat> into the charts as well. I'll give you some stuff about all the charts here, yeah. the charts as well. So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, from the Kurt Donny Band, Mr. Josh Bedis and his song called Moving On. Moving On. And we'll Yay. get out of the way. Thank you very much. <laughs> Really, really brilliant, really is. Right then, boys. That's okie dokie. So, then, gentlemen, that is a, a song by Josh called Moving On, which is available on iTunes, Spotify, Amazon, and all the well known download sites. 
And I really enjoyed that boys too. Really, really, really yeah. good song. Um it's good. Yeah, it's so good. You can, the, the viewers and that can get and your fans can get them from all, all your songs off, was it just that when it's on Spotify? Um, I got others? another one out as well, called At the End of the Day, that's on Cool. Well. That's brilliant. So if you I'll try and put us a link in here for Josh's songs and just <coughs> go to it and you'll be able to get the moving on plus the other tracks that you'll, you'll be releasing. Um, so what gigs have you got coming up mate? Will you have an album coming out soon? Um, getting ready to do an EP. Yeah. I'm going to do a strip back and acoustic, just like yeah. a simple acoustic bass mm. and maybe some fiddle. Yeah. Then I've got a big studio album planned then, and a few of my mates in. And, uh, Brilliant. We like to know, say, I mean, um, as it, it's, it's, it's hard for the moment for the, to get the material out there because, I mean, we've, we've just released a 34th album we have. Yeah. In a thirty fourth album this year actually, and he said that's we uh, released that to iTunes and all that as well. Yeah. And uh, also as hard copy CDs, and um, but the cost, like you two may say, for new acts coming up, it's a lot of money to put behind it. You've oh, really yeah. got to put it's so, yeah, it's really distributors, advertisements. Yeah. Like so, things. but once you get the first one out, then mate, don't you worry. How yeah. uh, good, great these songs are. There'll be some more albums following soon. I'm sure there will. You, you, they will, mate. I tell you that. Don't tell the missus. You'll be straight in the wall. <laughs> <Tell, tell laughs> I'll never see that again. I know. I know. We're, we've all got good lives. Isn't we? So we know all about that. that. So you can hear the change in my pocket. Before <laughs> in the um, that's for a bean out as well. Yeah, if, <laughs> a bean out is that's actually good lad. If you can have a bean out to go out, so and we've had quite a few of them. Haven't yeah, we? Bean out. Um, no, that's right. It's coming back in. She doesn't like. <laughs> <laughs> you put it on the bottom of the stairs. <laughs> right. Your next song, mate, is called. The Old House. Yeah. What's the story behind that one? Um, it's a song about divorce. Again, another yeah. happy tune. Yeah. It's country music, mate. Yeah, not mine, thankfully, but <laughs> you never know after she sees yeah. this. After she sees it, <laughs> Richard does watch it. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, sort of thing there. He loves you, really. Yeah. yeah. Someone's got to. <laughs> oh! oh. oh. I think we might have to edit that, mate. Yeah. <laughs> I'm feeling brave now for hours away. <laughs> we won't release this till about May, Tommy, me that, right? <laughs> And you'll think I was never on that show. Uh, so, so it's about divorce, man. Yeah, yeah? yeah. So it's one of those heartbreak. Is it comeback songs or um, sort of stay away songs yeah, yeah. or um, yeah, that, that sort of like um, a broken home yeah. being rebuilt. Okay. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's a little so, bit of both. Yeah. Picking up the pieces. <laughs> All seriousness, land gentlemen. Uh, <clears throat> we're looking forward to this one because the, the last couple of songs have been fantastic, and uh, this one's called "The Old House" by Mr. Josh Bedis. And take it away, Not shaking Stevens. <laughs> Not shaking Stevens. <laughs> <laughs> this old house. Copyright. <laughs> Woohoo! Go for it. Just a shell of everything 
baby. Groovy. Yep. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, that's uh, a new song by Josh called The Old House. Um, what is your routine of really, where do you get your, your inspiration from and how do you put your songs about? Is it um, lyrics first? Is it chords first? Or? Um, like, depends on the song, really. I like to keep it quite organic mm -hmm. and um, there's a good chance like, they write themselves pretty much. Yeah. I do keep a notepad with me and work, and I write ideas down. Yeah. I might work off those ideas. Mm -hmm. Other times, then I'll just play around with the guitar. Yeah. And something will come from that. But and you've got something to be in before now, you? Ten minutes time. Before. And uh, that was the, <coughs> the trouble. The, the title was, "Am I going to get home off the time?" <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. From our point of view, it's great to see that um, young artists coming through and doing their own original yeah. songs. Because when we first started. The British country music scene was massive. It was really massive. But a you lot had, of bands are doing covers. You had a country music club on every corner. Yeah. And you had festivals all over the place, but uh, it was always covers that they did. And uh, we always wanted to see about doing original material. And, yeah. And, like uh, the Americans are running for their money, aren't you? But the thing <laughs> was, <laughs> waiting for them to come out. Yeah. The see, the thing is, because <laughs> our inspiration, that, like you say, back in the day, you had like a spot earlier on there, uh, Hank Hillman. Yeah. Uh, he's from Wales. He was in. The whole war gang, we've had Hank on, haven't we? And um, hello, Hank. Hello, mate. And uh, you had other acts as well that came along, but we, we've always been torchbearers for originality. Yeah. And it's absolutely, from my point of view, it's absolutely brilliant to sit, well, to stand there and hear original songs because yeah. they're brilliant. Man, they're going to yeah, perform. Really they're really I mean, we, we've got a lot of doors thrown in our face. Yeah. Because they do original material. Yeah. But there's more so, opportunities for the young ones now. Don't give up our voices. Don't, don't give up. Keep at it. Because yeah, somebody somewhere wants to yeah, yeah. Place, so. as long as, we've always turned around and said, if you go into a venue and 84 people, two stop, you get two that want to listen to your songs, yeah. you've done your job, pure and simple, mate. Um, so, have you got your own agent, or do you, or do you want, how do the agents and promoters get in contact mm. direct through your Facebook? Um, and then? I usually just hassle them on the internet, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're all done that. Yeah. You're all done that. <laughs> no, that's how we've got to talk yeah, about, yeah. we've got a week long band. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Trying to promote new singles. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Facebook jail. That, that's what it's all about, you know what I mean? Facebook jail. <laughs> We've been there. We've been there. And we don't get Bailey. No, no. <laughs> um, but it's, uh, that's the sort of thing that you do and just keep knocking on yeah. doors, hopefully it works for you and so forth. Um, you never start coming back, you know, people know who you are. And yeah. You've got to keep at it. You've got you to be standing in the yeah. audience at all, do you? No. You know, I mean, you can't promote just standing in the audience and being, I like this guy. Yeah. I like Especially it. now, I haven't got their phone today, you're recording stuff and you yeah. don't know who's seen it then. That's true. So uh, but like I said, the thing is just to keep at it, keep sending your songs out to DJs as well and promoters, the radios, UKCountryRadio.com because Alan Rockish is a great supporter of Hi Alan. Hi mate. Yeah. And then... Um, he loves us a bit. You know what I mean? So... Yeah, yeah that's what... friends as well and we will help each other out. That's I've always thinking. said that all the way through because my, my thing is to... It's always been... Don't forget the people on the way up. Because yeah, yeah. you have to make them on the way back down again. Well, it's no good hoarding knowledge either. What's the point in holding stuff up and then not sharing it around? Share it around. That's what we're here for. At the end of the day, I mean, we, we, we ain't got no egos. We, we have a laugh yeah. and a joke. And we, if we can help somebody, we will. Yeah. yeah. You know, because we, we've been here now in the business a long time and we've got a lot of experience. And we're still and struggling. We've got a lot of experience and knowledge. So yeah. if you pass that knowledge on and give someone an helping hand. But you look at um, all the greats coming up Johnny Cash, um, Willie Nelson, Waylon Jennings, they all played together. They all covered each other's songs, yeah. they all went on tour. That's what it's all about and that's what we believe in, that's what need, it needs to be done nowadays. Yes, and the thing is, I've always, way, no. I've always turned around and said that as long as it's originality, because original, yeah the covers are great, but you, nobody can beat the cover, no. the original, the original that, that cover. And I've always believed in originality, to keep originality going. And if I didn't play original, I'd lose these two, because these are two. So I'd <laughs> yeah. The quiet man in the back, you're all right mate, there. You'll be, be asleep soon, he will, don't you, mate? <laughs> um, so, your next song, mate, it's called, you've told me, called Ballad of Rambling Joe. Rambling Joe. Yeah. What's the story about that? Um, I wrote it about a buddy of mine in Wick. You know, he's um, a lot older than me, and he's always like quiet, for a little old man. Like. And then he started delving into his um, past a bit, and he's a bloody wild child. <laughs> <laughs> he ran away from home when he was like 15 and just travelled abroad picking fruit and drinking beer. Yeah. So uh, I thought I'd make a brilliant song, yeah? Cool. And he kept that going until he uh, married his missus. And then she's in for a thumb on it. So it was a white. They always say you're going to watch the quiet ones. 
That's why he's caught in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible when you get a drinking session with him, mate. Oh, okay. <laughs> that, that one in the back. So this is uh, another uh, song from Josh, original again. Is this on an EP or anything? Is this original? No, it's not yet. No. Not yet, but it's no. a fan for the album, it is. Cool. Yeah. Uh, it's called Ballad of Ramblin' Joe by Mr. Josh Bedders. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Oh. Getting old, isn't it? Destined to settle, find a good job and a wife. Lay down their roots while they're younger, work hard the rest of their lives. Work hard the rest of their lives. Joe was a bit of a rambler. Born under a wandering star He rode his thumb to the border It's <laughs> 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 a cure for that, you make him laugh. You're riding him like a bloody rodeo bull. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't sure if they were uh, back in the difference. <laughs> <laughs> what's, it, uh, what's it called again? <laughs> Doing and banjos by the look of it. <laughs> <laughs> the ball of the Bramblin' Joe. Take, take two, two. Take two. two. Behave yourselves, you two. Where you picking? Where you picking? So Dodgy Goins on in the middle of the voice. <laughs> <laughs> Some men were destined to settle, find a good job and a wife. Lay down their roots while the younger work hard the rest of their lives. Work hard the rest of their lives. Joe was a bit of a rambler, born under a wandering star. He rode his thumb to the border, topped off in every bar. Topped off in every
Now, you pay, go and apologise to that boy. <laughs> you apologise <laughs> to that boy now. And we're going to get that right take somewhere, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Sit you down, sit you down, you naughty, naughty boy. That's another story. We're going to get the head take somewhere, right? <laughs> now we're going to go back to Wales and tell everybody what we do behind the camera. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, I just whispered to you guys with that one. I love that one. Oh, I you. really like that one, mate. Yeah. That That's gonna be your next single, man. <laughs> Give it out there. Hey. Ballad of Rambling I really do like that, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we do apologise. Uh, well, as you know, we've been, as we've guessed now, we've been rather naughty. Well, I wasn't this time because I was behind the camera that was these pets. What's going on? Drink? Drink? I've just got me drink, that's all. You know what I mean? But well, it just proves, I just said that. <laughs> it just proves that Josh, you could help, but you had to you <laughs> caught him out, we did it, you yeah. know what I mean? I've seen most things, boys, but I've never seen that. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want to send questions in, send some questions in. That, that, you being might have to tell the right answer, though. Be, being serious, though, as, as you know, we never are. That is, I really do like, yeah. like that song, man. Really nice track. Yeah, you know, you're a talented, talented songwriter, man. You really are. Oh, thank you. Get those songs out there. Yeah. Get the songs out there. Get your, can I say, ass. Get your bum in the studio. Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> your butt. Get your bum in the studio and get that down. Yeah. Cut so it, man. That's how you sing. <sighs> Every time he has to mention it. Can't help it. I've got a boy for the last 31 years of life, now ain't cheating yeah. anything about it, so. You know what I mean? That's why we've got a good producer that makes us say. He's showing me a new call called C. Never had C before. <laughs> right, anyway, um, you enjoyed yourself. Have a good old time. We ain't doing this. But for the last couple of uh, guests we've had, they're still getting therapy, we're hearing about it. They've had that for many years ago. They've had the Valium tablets. <laughs> um, so thanks again for coming on board, mate. You know, yeah, it's been a pleasure. Boys, well, thank you so much, mate, for coming on board. Uh, would you ever come on again? No. <laughs> 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 At least he's on. At least he's on. It's a song called that. Yeah, we have, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah we have. Because I'm already paying. That's all right, mate. We'll come down to your house next time. Yeah. You <laughs> Just give me your heads up, face. <laughs> I'll give you Ian's address. Go in, then get in. Go in, the Alfred. Uh, my old mugger, is it? Um, but thank you again for coming all this way, mate. Um, would you like to do your final track? I give it a go. <laughs> it's like, you know, it's, you know, it's been a joy to come on board uh, for part one of the Spring TV show. Uh, we'll try and come and see you some of your gigs. We'll try oh, and, if we can in the future, put some shows together or whatever. Yeah, that'd, be that'd be lovely, yeah. yeah. Lovely! Lovely, lovely is it? Oh, you know what I mean? I've got to say, for you most people, I forget what you mean, but Jackie Da! Oh my goodness. What does that mean? Good offer about my mother. Good offer about my mother. You've just upset all the Welsh fans now, we're doing that. Very far language. Oh, I'll tell you what, <laughs> you apologise. <laughs> I apologise now, I apologise now. Well, I was told it meant good health. So <laughs> I apologise. <laughs> but I apologise if I'm offended anybody. <laughs> We're going to have Ian Calford hanking all them on you now. <laughs> right then. See, we always agree. What a title for a song, anyway. You boy always agree. So, <laughs> thank you again, mate, for coming on board this madness. Uh, if you want to stick around to see all, but you're welcome to. But oh, if you want to go back across the border, get me back now. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> it normally happens. Very anyway. sweet. So <laughs> thank you again, mate, from me, Kerr, Andy, Marty. Thanks for coming on board. Oh, thank you. And uh, here's Josh's final track. Good night, kiss from Jim Beam. Yeah, and if anyone from Jim Beam is watching, I drink a nice rag stag. And yeah, I can find his way to my house. Yeah. And other <laughs> drinks are available. <laughs> Slow Jack Jane, Jack, Jack Daniels, Jack Daniels and all that. So, so comfort. Thank you again, mate, for thank coming you. on board. I hope you really enjoyed yourself, oh, all man. This. Right. So from <laughs> us, and thanks Josh again, is Josh Bedis with his final song called Goodnight Kiss from Jim B. Thank you. Yay! <laughs> Yay. We do apologise, oh, ladies and gentlemen, for this poor lad. <laughs> we are sorry. Don't give me a pub. We are a pub. You know the fact the fans are pub is. So this is Johnny Shaman. This is Johnny the pub. Three, two, one. Go. Ah! Right. And uh, Josh never seen that before. He says it. You don't know. So this is Josh. We apologise. We apologise. Sorry. This is Josh Bendis. We <laughs> take four, five, take, whatever. What time? Eight hundred and sixty-three. Take a thousand sorry. of. 
Good night, kiss from Jim Bing. Right then. Yeah, he's, he's a song. Need a glass of I tell you, he's, plug, he's <laughs> plugging this, you know. He wants some free booze. That's all he's doing it yeah, for. Yeah, he's a song then. Uh, he wants some free booze. That's all he wants, <laughs> mate. Don't know the country out has hit the bottle. <laughs> <laughs> Take three. three. Had no evening gone away. When the evening turns to night And the sunshine goes away I know you're no longer there Waiting for me in our bed So I settle for a goodnight kiss from Lord Jim B He got there, like he kept messing up, he kept blaming us, I don't know what he kept blaming us for. <laughs> you know, these young ones, you know, they keep blaming us all. But thanks mate for coming on board. Thank you for I'm having me. I'm glad you enjoyed the madness <laughs> here again. Uh, so, for myself, Kerr, from Andy oh, Marty, really? thank you mate for coming on board. Oh, thank you for having and, uh, me. And he said he's going to stay and get his arm back, which I never he means by that, you know what I mean? He's <laughs> ever, <laughs> he's, he's ever <laughs> so naughty. So, we'll see you in a bit. Cheers now. Bye. Bye. Bye.